Hello, Kit Baskin here. I wanted to do some tint uh, comparisons. What we have here is about one o'clock in the afternoon, three inches or so of snow on the ground, a lot of south glass here. So here we have a good amount of natural light coming in here and you can you can get a basic idea of, of some of the coloration. Here's a giveaway from XTAR Direct. This makes everything pretty blue. Here is a um, an old uh, Photon Freedom. So and that's that's got the blue and the, the weird tint to it. Here's an old Rex, Photon Rex. Here is a UG Warm. going on and off. It's a really good color rendition. It is making the uh, the white a little bit warm, a little brownish. Here is a UG Neutral. Look how bright that thing is. I just put 2016 batteries into it. Fresh ones cost me a fortune at the hardware store. I need to take the 2016s out of that freebie flashlight with the purple tint. Here's the, uh, that was a free to, uh, that was an old, um, it's just a photon, uh, single, single mode. Okay, here's the, here's the, um, the photon 2, uh, that's got the, uh, the UG, the uh, more natural color. You can see it's pretty, pretty white. And here's a Nichia. This is a Matchbox Instruments. It's HF with a, a next generation switch on it. So that's got that same kind of warmth to it. Here's a, uh, a tip CRI. Probably one of the coolest of those uh, sunlight, sunlight tints. Here's a um, quite a bit older. SC62D, the um, zebra light. SC, you know, doesn't really look so great against these, but it, when you're out in the field and doing doing regular things, it's pretty good. Yeah. So this is the photon with the with the cooler UG, and this is I I managed to uh, switch out the emitter in a freedom photon which is what this is. This is one of the old ones. It's a, I think a 2003 is what it said on the circuit board. And here's the old Photon 2 with the cooler Nietzsche, uh, the cooler Yuji. So here's the, the Yuji. Here's the Nietzsche.